It's fall in eastern Ontario, and that means it's duck hunting season. This is hands down my most favorite time of the year. What I love most about it is being out in the ponds with my dogs. They absolutely love hunting and they absolutely love being out there in the fall. Maggie is exceptional at what she does. She gives it her all. She retrieves all the birds. She is truly an amazing hunting dog. Get the duck. Good girl, Maggie. Good girl. Good girl. Yes, girl. Scout. He's a bit excited. Has a bit too much energy. He doesn't like to sit still, but he still loves being out there for the day. Having him around makes hunting a little bit trickier, but I still love bringing him along for the adventure. And that's just a handful of reasons of why I love the fall and why I love waterfowl hunting. Now we've been hunting this area for five years. We've had some very, very good days of hunting here. Let's go! Get it, Maggie! Duck! Get the duck! Let's go! Good girl! Who's a good girl? Good girl! Are you a good girl? Are you a good girl, Maggie? And we've also had some really bad days. But over the years, you know, a lot of memories have been made. Maggie has had all her firsts here, retrieving her first duck, retrieving her first goose. Good girl, good girl. This is the place that made her into the dog she is today. And you know, just hunting this spot means so much, you know. It's more than just hunting, it's getting out with the dogs, building memories. I'm building memories every time I come here, whether I shoot birds or not. I'm just always so happy to be here. I'm so happy to be with the dogs out hunting for a few hours in the morning. It's just absolutely perfect. One solo mallard just swam or flew right in and I took it down. Maggie's out there getting it right now. Oh my gosh, this is freaking wild. Never have I ever shot my limit before. Good girl. Fred, just insane. I've never shot my limit before ever and uh, I just took it home. 4 a.m. You know what that means. We're going duck hunting. The dog's got to eat before heading out for this hunt. I hop in the car and head out. Make a quick stop for gas. Head over to the local Tim Hortons. Could I get two large coffees with two milk? Grab a couple coffees and a bagel, and we're off to the pond. I pull up to the pond and I get my gear figured out. I put my waders on. Ready to hunt, Maggie? Hey, Scout. Scout, you're crazy. You guys ready? And then I begin the half hour walk to the pond in the dark. I made it to the pond, started getting the decoys out. So I don't got a ton of decoys, I got about seven decoys. This pond is super small, so you don't need a lot of decoys. I got just a few mallards, drakes, hens, some wood ducks, hens and drakes as well. So what I got for shells today is I'm shooting Kent. Three inch, one quarter ounce, 1400 FPS, shot number two. I've shot these shells a fair bit. I'm pretty happy with them. My gun's got a full choke in it. Don't really need it for this pond with how small it is, but we're gonna do what we can. 
But these shells aren't bad. For the price, they're pretty inexpensive and they're good, decent shells. Well, it's pretty much shooting light now. Let's get loaded up. Shooting light hits, woodies are flying, but they're not coming within range. It was only a matter of time. Two ducks fly over my head. They make a few passes and then they dump right into the decoys. They couldn't have done it better. Let's go! Two down, baby! I managed to take both of those ducks, which absolutely made the morning. Let's go! Two down, baby! Maggie jumps out into the pond to retrieve the first bird. Good shooting, Ryan. Come on, girl. Good girl. They dumped right into the decoys, man. That was perfect. Look at that. Beautiful hen mallard right there, folks. We gotta go find that other duck and then we gotta get back at it. Oh, there's ducks. There's ducks flying. Check that out. Oh, here we go, here we go. Those are woodies. Those are woodies. Okay, I'm gonna go find that duck. Okay, come on, Maggie. Let's go get the duck. Get the duck. The other one landed in the cattails. It's time to go find it. After a few minutes of looking, I see Maggie with her head down, sniffing the ground, and I walk up and there it is. She doesn't always bring back the birds that fall onto land, but if you see her with her head down, nose to the ground, you know she's on it. Good girl! Good girl! Yes, girl! Beauty! There we go, baby. Two ducks in the bag. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Whew. Check this out, folks. What a way to start the morning. Might be the end of the hunt because there's not a lot of ducks around, but these two ducks I saw on the pond last week and I knew they'd still be here. Now a hunt like this is one that I find the most memorable. I would much rather go on a solo hunt with both my dogs and shoot only one or two ducks than go out with six to 10 guys and shoot a six to 10 man limit. It's way more rewarding for me when I go out, do it all myself and manage to take home some birds. And the fact that I get to spend that time with my dogs is just, it's unmatched. You guys know Maggie, she's been hunting for years and she absolutely loves it. Bird or no bird. Scout, same thing. Bird or no bird, he absolutely loves being out there. Scout hates sitting still, so he likes to move around a lot. And I'll typically let him go for swims in the pond, like in between waves, but... Maggie is just cued in. She's ready to rock. She ain't moving unless a bird's in the water. So for me, you know, going out with my dogs is the most rewarding type of duck hunt. I'd take that over any other hunt. Talk about an experience, man, you know, going on a solo hunt, bringing both your dogs with you and getting on some ducks. Like, you can't beat this. To me, this is better than going out with a bunch of guys and hitting a five, six man limit. I enjoy this way more. Just spending time with my dogs on a little pond, shooting a couple ducks. What a morning. Well folks, that's gonna be the end of the video. I had an amazing morning out here with both of my dogs, taking home two birds today, my first two ducks of the season. This morning was absolutely perfect. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button. If you got any questions or concerns, leave a comment below because we love hearing from you guys. And if you ain't subscribed to the channel, make sure to subscribe because we're dropping videos every Sunday. Thank you all for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.